morning, my beautiful people. My name is Tony with Addicted to Fishing 507. Welcome to another fishing adventure. Oh my God. Here we go, fish on nice cheap head. So I'm gonna, oh, here we go. It worked. On this episode, we're gonna be targeting cheap heads mainly with some fiddler crabs, just catch and release. Just for the pure love of the sport. So stay tuned, okay? Oh my God, they are in there. I don't know why I didn't hook them up. That's why they're so sketchy sometimes. So sketchy sometimes. You know what's funny? I got these crabs yesterday, right? They stay alive the entire night just to die when I came to the fishing spot. And I don't know if it is because, I don't know. They probably just playing possum because it's very cold, right? So, it looked like they just got either frozen or I don't know what the deal is, honestly. Oh, I had him, dude. All right, had him doesn't count. I got one. Oh, what is this? It's a mango snapper? Oh, yeah. It's a good size snapper. Not going for snappers, but that's a good start. Oh, look, he's just pissing all over the place. Little snapper, probably about eight inches. Not going for snappers. I know the cheap heads are here. The problem is finding that piling where they are congregated. That is what is going to be interested. I've seen a whole bunch of them here a while back when I was walking by, helping a friend of mine that leave back there. And the little break we took. I came over here and they were all over the place. But then again, that day we didn't have no gear. <sighs> Another one. Oh, this. Oh, what the heck was that? Are you freaking serious? I don't know what it was, dude. 
it barely touched the surface of the water and the hook came off we're back in business you see what I'm saying this crab is alive but some of them are alive but most of them just like stop as soon as as soon as I got to the cold weather I got them on my apartment they were very alive and now they all like froze up in there nope 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 that's exactly what I wanted it that's what I was getting the hits in there and all let's see if they're still in there or not I got picked up I got picked up oh that's a good fish that's a good fish it's gonna break me off on the pylon this is better fish it's definitely a cheap head oh my god that's a massive cheap head dude that is a massive cheap head That is a massive cheap head, dude. That's what I came here to get, dude. I told you there were big ones here. Hopefully he doesn't come up, dude. Oh, he got wrapped around. Hopefully you don't cut me off. This is the kind of times that I wish to have. Oh, not maybe not so massive. <sighs> but it's definitely a keeper size cheap head I know that I see them here big and that's not even that's actually a little one compared to the ones I seen here <laughs> look look at the teeth see what I'm saying tell me that don't look like a human like teeth and then they got the bottom teeth up there on top of their mouth that's what they used to crush to crush the lures I mean to crush the little crabs this is definitely a keeper man this is a, this is a solid pound pound and a half maybe but guess what I'm not keeping any fish right now today period I'm not keeping any fish ah, that's a little deeper waters in there that's definitely a keeper size fish I'm gonna be making my way back to Fort Myers. Uh, I was only able to catch snapper, a small cheap head, and pretty decent cheap head. It was definitely a keeper. Probably estimated it to be 13, maybe 14 inches. Yep, very stuck in there. Maybe this one is. Oh yeah, started moving already. And this is a big one, dude. That's a big one. You see how big this thing is? Oh my god, dude. That will, <laughs> that will feed a family of five right there. <laughs> Look, there's another big one right here. There's the mother load of them. Look. A lot. Two. <laughs> All right, so stay tuned, okay? Should be sheep heads on those pylons. Let me toss my, let me toss one of the crabs out there and see if I'm correct. Feel the crab? Little knocker rig, very small weight. You need to allow the current to take the crab on the bottom. You see that? That's how, that's how I hook them. A lot of people do it different ways. I think I got picked up. Oh yeah. I'm getting hit right now. Here we go, fish on. Yeah, it's another cheap hit. Oh! 
fighting like a cheap hit. If it's not a cheap hit, it could be a catfish or a small red. Could be a small red, dude. Oh my god. Oh yeah, it's a, it's a cheap. It's a cheapy. It's a cheapy. It was fighting good, dude. It was fighting good. So yeah, just like I thought. I mean, they, they, I thought to myself, oh, pacing all over the place, huh? I thought to myself, there's got to be cheap heads on that violin. Oh man, these cheap heads, thick. Oh, I was trying to get a shot of her when I was releasing it and she did not want to play. All right, let's see if I can do that again, huh? It really doesn't matter if your crabs are dead or alive. I mean, they still gonna hit it. Feel their crap. Hook them to the bottom. Let's see how long it takes to catch one. Here we go. Oh, I'm already getting hit. I'm already getting hit. Literally, as soon as I hit the water. Oh, I'm on. I'm on. Oh, this is a better size cheap head. Can't even see where my line is. Oh, right here. All right. She's out of the pylons. I don't know why I'm saying she. <laughs> oh my god, these guys are feisty. They almost, they almost fight like a, like a Jack Cravel almost. Oh yeah, little cheapy. You see? My drag is not tight to the point that this fish can just take me out. Oh my god, this is a good size. I can literally just come here and limit on them. No problem. I think I'm gonna bring my daughters here. Little chip, 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 chip. Definitely a keeper. Oh god. <laughs> Get a backflip. All right, I'm actually doing a quick stop right now because I have catch them in the past here. So I'm gonna see if I have the same luck today. I know that I put some cheap heads in here in the past and I also caught a few snooks here. So let's check this out. Stay tuned, okay? Dude, I'm already getting bit. He probably just took my my crap. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I'm getting picked up. Ah, oh, come on. There is something down there. Maybe mango snappers. Who knows? Hopefully, there is a giant chip head that comes along with all that.
picked up already. Here we go, fish on. Nice cheap head. Nice cheap head. Ooh, look at the size of that cheap head. <laughs> oh my god, there's a lovely cheap head. Look at the size of that cheap head, dude. Dude, that's probably the biggest one I ever caught. The biggest cheap head I ever caught for sure. Hopefully, dolphins don't show up. That cheap head looks huge from up here. And you know, everything looks smaller in the water. That is a giant, dude. Hopefully, he don't take me back to the rocks over there. Holy crap, mother load of freaking cheap head, dude. Mother load of cheap head. Hopefully he doesn't come off. He don't look like he's ready to come up. But the hook is on his top lip. Hey, what's going on? He's not done. He is not done. That is a good cheap head, dude. On very light tackle. That is a huge cheap head dude <laughs> look at that look to where the hook is at dude top lip barely even hooked oh actually he was well hooked in fact look actually it's not so big is that's not the biggest one i ever caught is it's a good size most definitely a dinner size funny looking teeth I would say today was a success, mission accomplished. Look at this guy. Yeah, definitely mission accomplished. Today was definitely good. There you go. It's not a giant, but most definitely the species that we came to target. I am not gonna harvest any of the fish that I caught on this video. Look at this, ain't that something? Human-like teeth. They almost look like horse teeth. This is probably about a pound and a half or two pound chip head. Pretty good. They taste very good, that's for sure. We just catch and release. Catch and release. Live to fight another day. You know, I'm gonna do one last cast. I got a feeder crap on right now. And I got probably about a dozen still in there that I have dead. So I'm gonna do one of those let it sink for a little bit and see if they come into play Oh, here we go. It worked. Oh my God. Oh my God, dude. I got my, my drag fairly loose, but this one feels even better than the bigger one. Oh, it's not quite as big. Nope, nope, it's not quite as big. It's a good size though, definitely a keeper. Definitely a keeper. So on the last cast, I caught one more <laughs> today's been an epic day man I I actually don't target sheephead as much it was fun 
it was definitely fun I ended up checking out two spots caught several cheap hits in both of those spots well folks appreciate the time thank you for staying tuned until the end of this video don't forget to like comment subscribe if you haven't already do so hey and i see y'all in the next adventure all right